church and persecuted God's children, even having a put to death. Yet down on the little road walking, the Lord came and, and, and visited him and in about five minutes according to the record of God it couldn't have taken very long that God, that the Lord came and visited Saul and about five minutes of time in the presence of the Lord it transformed that man's life. And I can't read where that he ever heard another human being. Five minutes of time in the audience with Jesus. I'm yeah. telling you, you'll be a different man or a different woman. If you'll just humble your heart down before the Lord. But I want you to know that sometimes it seems like that even the children of God can get themselves uh, into such a mess, brother, and sometimes it seems like that uh, no matter which way we go, brother, we uh, uh, listen that uh, any time we begin to lean on ourselves, uh, uh, Brother Mike, we can get ourselves uh, uh, in trouble, the Bible says, uh, and even pierce ourselves through with sorrows. Uh, uh, listen to me, brother, and uh, uh, we're not exempt from that, uh, uh, but I'm glad today that we've got uh, uh, somebody, brother, living on the inside. Side, uh, uh, that'll help us, uh, uh, even uh, uh, the disciples the very day uh, uh, that they took bread, uh, 
uh, from the Lord's hand, uh, and they took that cup, uh, um, brother, of the fruit of the vine, uh, and Jesus bowed down, and he washed their feet, brother Joe. Uh, I'm glad, brother, listen, uh, uh, that he done that for an example. Uh, uh, oh, brethren, uh, I'm glad today that uh, uh, when Jesus had done these things, uh, uh, listen, that it's recorded uh, uh, right in the record of God uh, uh, that the disciples uh, uh, on such a very sacred evening uh, uh, that they even begin to argue uh, uh, with one another. But yeah. Mike, uh, uh, you think you're not human, you better think again. Uh, uh, oh, but listen to me. Uh, uh, they even begin to argue uh, and fuss about who was going to be uh, uh, the greatest in the kingdom of heaven. Uh, uh, they had just let Jesus wash their feet. Uh, uh, they had just taken the bread uh, and the fruit of the bun. And here they were, uh, uh, ready to argue over something yeah. that silly. Uh, uh, oh, but some men, uh, uh, they may look around and they'll think, uh, uh, well, I'm glad I ain't like that. Uh, I'm glad that I ain't got those kind of feelings. Uh, I got news for everybody today. Uh, uh, there was two men came into the temple one day. Uh, uh, yeah! Uh, one man walked right up uh, and sat on the front bench. Uh, uh, listen, he began to say, Lord, uh, uh, he began to pray a little bit. And he said, uh, I thank you, God, uh, uh, that I'm not like that other little fella that came. Uh, uh, he is a sinner, Lord. Uh, uh, but I thank you uh, uh, that I go to church every Sunday. Uh, I, I pay my tithes. I anoint my head with oil. Uh, oh, but uh, the Bible said uh, that that other little man came in uh, uh, to the temple and he got down uh, uh, on his knees and he wouldn't even lift his head uh, uh, towards heaven, brother mine. Uh, uh, but he began to cry out and say, uh, uh, Yeah, uh, Lord, forgive me, uh, uh, for I am a sinner. Uh, and you know what? When Jesus told uh, uh, the people that, uh, he looked right at them and he said, Which man uh, uh, went away justified, Brother John? Uh, uh, I got news for you today. Uh, uh, sometimes we can get ourselves uh, uh, a little bit of trouble, yeah. Brother and uh, I'll never forget this. Uh, as long as I live, uh, uh, we was trying to get our little church started uh, uh, probably about 20 years ago, uh, uh, 21 years ago, uh, and there's only a few of us showed up one night. Uh, uh, oh, Lord, uh, uh, Brother Joey and Sister Robin even came, uh, and you know what? Their membership, uh, uh, it was still in the, uh, uh, the Indian Bottom Association. Uh, uh, Brother David, you make me think of this. Uh, uh, listen, uh, and they, they came up, and we was getting ready to start church, uh, and that old moderator, Brother Junior Dameron, uh, uh, he looked at Brother Joey, uh, and he said, Brother Joey, I got a question for you. Uh, are you going to serve God today? Or are you going to serve man? And it put Joey on the spot. And he said, well, I hope I'm going to serve God. He said, then get your song and begin to sing. Oh, Lord, I, I want you to understand how sometimes how we can get caught up in things that we ought not to get caught up, Brother Jimbo. I'm as guilty as anybody else. I ain't pointing the finger at nobody but myself, Brother Jerry. You see, when I moved down here about 22 years ago, I was without a church, David. I didn't know what I was going to do. I had even petitioned a few of them, and they didn't seem to want me, Brother Roy. That's no surprise. Oh, Lord, about one day we joined, uh, uh, we joined, uh, you brother prayed for us, uh, we joined a little association.
congregation. Uh, our little church went in. Uh, and you know what? We had correspondence. Uh, I know some of you ain't familiar uh, uh, with associations uh, and the way it works. Uh, uh, but I'm going to tell you sometimes, uh, uh, good men, we can take our eyes uh, uh, right off the prize and yeah. sit down, uh, And we can get it seated on each other. Uh, uh, oh, Lord, uh, uh, when I came down here, uh, I didn't have any work. Uh, I didn't know what I was going to do. Uh, and by the end, I started uh, uh, substitute teaching. Uh, uh, listen, I'd go here, uh, and I'd go there, and I was doing everything uh, that I know to do. Uh, and brother, in our little church, uh, it was starting to grow, uh, and yet lettered up to an association. And I listen, and one job I landed, John, I was over in Floyd County, there at the Garth Vocational School, and I was there right in June, and school was getting ready to let out, and they said, you can stay here, and you can teach the rest of the year out. Oh, Lord, I stayed and I taught a bunch of high school men and women uh, uh, right in that class uh, and when the day uh, uh, when the school year was about through uh, uh, a couple of them little young boys uh, uh, they came over to me Jonathan uh, and they asked me uh, uh, they said Mr. Newsom uh, uh, we love being in your class uh, uh, but we've heard rumors uh, uh, that you're a preacher uh, and we love to come uh, and we love to hear you preach uh, and one boy uh, uh, looked right at me, Brother Ed, uh, and he said, Mr. Newsom, uh, I've never been to church. Uh, uh, Mom and Dad uh, have never taken me to church. Uh, uh, the only church uh, I've ever listened to uh, was in a funeral somewhere. Uh, and he said, I love uh, to get to hear you preach. Uh, uh, well, you know what? I looked right out little windows like that, uh, and I could see a little red brick building, uh, and you know what, uh, that church was in uh, another association, uh, uh, but we was in correspondence with one another, uh, you brothers know what I'm talking about, uh, oh Lord, uh, I looked over uh, at that little red brick building sitting there, uh, and I said, uh, Cameron, uh, if you boys will meet me someday, uh, uh, they have church every Sunday there. Uh, I'll meet you at that little church. Uh, and Brother Ed, uh, I begin to worry. Uh, uh, what if I show up and God don't bless me? Uh, and Brother, I got one shot uh, to influence these young ones. Uh, I was teaching them one thing, uh, but I was really teaching them something else. I uh, was uh, trying to get to them uh, the best that I know. Uh, uh, oh, Lord, a uh, uh, Sunday morning, uh, uh, come around. I was sitting in a little seat like this, uh, and I looked out the window. Uh, I could see the driveway, uh, and I seen a car pull in. Uh, I watched that little boy, Cameron. Uh, uh, he was 17 years old, brother Ed. Uh, uh, he got out of that car, uh, and the car turned around, uh, and it went back somewhere else. Uh, and listen, that boy came in, uh, and he sat down on the back seat, brother James. Uh, I went back, and I said, uh, Cameron, it's good to see you. Uh, he said, Dad dropped me off uh, and went back home to get in bed. Uh, oh, Lord, I begin to pray again. God of Abraham, let me say something, Lord. If it's your will, yeah. you were God right through me. And you know what? If God's ever blessed me, I believe he done it that day. I felt good. I didn't want to sit down, Brother Jerry. Oh, Lord, you know what? I never saw that boy again. A school is let down. And you know what? All summer long, I'm Brother Nate, I kept thinking. About him. Uh, uh, listen, uh, and in early August, uh, our associations met uh, with other associations, uh, and men.
man, a, a Christian man, a, a good, a good man of God. Uh, uh, they begin to argue for the Roy, uh, and they fought, uh, and they dropped correspondence, uh, uh, one with another. Uh, and I wonder about that, uh, uh, what a mess uh, uh, we can sometimes make. Uh, uh, oh, but uh, uh, right after that, uh, I got a phone call one morning. Uh, uh, listen, uh, it was that young boy calling me, uh, and he said, uh, is this Mr. Newsome? Uh, and I said, yeah. And he said, Mr. Newsome, uh, I don't know if you remember me or not, uh, uh, but I'm Cameron uh, uh, from school. Uh, I said, Cameron, uh, I ain't been able to forget about you uh, uh, all summer long. Uh, uh, oh, Lord, uh, how that young man began to say, uh, I heard something that day in church, uh, and I've been hungry uh, uh, to hear it again. Uh, uh, will you come back over to that church uh, and preach again? Uh, uh, how do you explain it, Brother James? Uh, uh, that, well, now uh, I'm not allowed to go there anymore. Uh, I'm telling you what, uh, I'm so sick and tired uh, of men's ways. Uh, I can't stand it, Brother Mike. Uh, uh, oh, Lord, uh, uh, you know what I did? Uh, I began to make excuses to that boy. Uh, and I said, buddy, uh, uh, let me begin to work uh, and I'll find us a place. Uh, I, I wouldn't tell him what the real reason was, John. I, I didn't know how to explain it. I still yeah. don't. It's just it's just it. It. Uh, oh, but uh, that very next week, uh, I climbed into my car and I turned on the radio. Uh, I was driving somewhere else for work. Uh, and you know what? Uh, they came over uh, uh, with the obituary. Uh, and that little boy's name, uh, it was read off for the jury. Uh, uh, killed in a car wreck. Uh, uh, his own aunt driving uh, and accidentally pulled in front of somebody uh, and took that boy uh, out of this world. Uh, oh, Lord, uh, I remember to cry, uh, and I begin to cry out for yeah. my uh, yeah. and I say, God, uh, if you bless me, uh, I'm going to preach where you want me to preach. Uh, I don't care where I am. Uh, I don't care what men yeah. say anymore. Uh, uh, oh, yeah. oh, Lord, uh, uh, this world, uh, it's going in the wrong way. Uh, let's call men and women. Well, one of them, uh, I can't even put them under conviction. Oh, no. uh, uh, that takes God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, but I'm telling you one thing. Uh, uh, when God starts that word, uh, if you bless me, uh, I'll just give them a little water. Uh, oh, Lord, uh, I love to go into God's garden. Uh, and I'd love to be able uh, to put a little water. It needs a little water in the yeah. chains. Uh, cool. That's all we do anyhow. Yeah. Uh, and you know what? Uh, God Almighty, uh, He gives the increase, yeah. brother. Right. Uh, oh, yeah. Lord, uh, let's all uh, band together. Uh, uh, let's march onward. Uh, uh, let's keep looking upward. Uh, I'll tell you what. Uh,
telling you one thing here. Uh, I know uh, uh, that I can make mistakes. Uh, I know I can mess up for the mic. Uh, uh, yeah, but I, I met a man uh, called Jesus uh, uh, that's never uh, uh, made a mistake. Uh, and he never is. Uh, and he's never going to do that uh, if Jesus uh, is working, David, uh, inside of you. I just surrender. Uh, uh, that's all I know. Uh, I tell men and women today, uh, it's surrender, uh, and you'll be all right. Uh, I'm telling you what, uh, uh, listen, our world, uh, it's such in a bad spot. Uh, I just turned on the news uh, uh, this morning, uh, and I heard about a little balloon uh, uh, that had 16 people in it uh, uh, down in Texas, uh, and it crashed. And he killed all 16 of them. Oh, then, just a few miles, right on down the road from that, somebody started shooting somebody else. You see, we're living in a broken world. It ain't going to get much better here, Bill. But I, I'm glad to be. I know.
have public opening of this church door to, to receive anybody that would like to come and be with them. I was hoping that David would join me. <laughs>
associations coming up the second weekend in September. If you don't have a place to go, we'd love to see you on Friday and Saturday and Sunday. It's going to be right there at our church. So come and be with us. I promise you it will be as good to be as we know how to do it. We're just us. <laughs>